Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hey guys, me. How's your day? In the previous meeting, we have learned about natural landscape. In this video, we are going to talk about man-made landscape. So, what is man-made landscape? And what are the examples of man-made landscapes? Let's take a look. Man-made landscapes are landscapes that have been affected, influenced, or shaped by human involvement. Jadi, kenampakan buatan adalah kenampakan yang sudah dipengaruhi oleh manusia atau dibuat oleh manusia. So, what are the examples of man-made landscape? Let's see. The first one is paddy field. Paddy field is a land used for growing crops like rice and taro. Sawah adalah tempat untuk menumbuhkan padi dan juga umbi. There are four types of paddy field in Indonesia. First, tada hujan. Second, irigasi. Third, pasang surut. And fourth, lebak. Next, plantation. A plantation is a large farm to plant crops like tea, rubber, coffee, palm, and sugarcane. Perkebunan adalah tempat untuk menanam tanaman seperti teh, karet, kopi, sawit, dan tebu. Residence. Residence is a place for human life. Perumahan adalah tempat di mana orang tinggal. Dump and reservoir. Dump is a building to retain water. Bendungan adalah bangunan untuk menampung air. Reservoir is an artificial lake used as a source of water supply. Waduk merupakan danau buatan untuk sumber air. Next, harbor. Harbor is a place where ships and boats can shelter. Pelabuhan adalah tempat di mana kapal bisa berlabuh. Airport. Airport is a place where aircraft regularly take off and land. Bandar udara adalah tempat di mana pesawat terbang dapat lepas landas dan mendarat. Next is bus station and train station, terminal, dan juga stasiun kereta api. Then, road and park, jalan dan juga taman. That's all about man-made landscape. Your task is, please, cut and paste the sticker on your book. Don't forget to give title on it. Thank you very much. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bye-bye.